In this class, we are going to learn how to make use of fields query parameter in Oracle Fusion REST API. For demonstration purpose, I am making use of this get all suppliers REST API. In almost all the get all Fusion REST APIs, we are having n number of query parameters as you are seeing on the screen. Based on our business requirement, we will be using one among those in order to get the data using this Fusion APIs. In our previous class, we had seen how to make use of limit, how to make use of offset and build the pagination with the help of this REST APIs. You can check out our previous class before going ahead with this class. Now coming to the fields. So by default, when we click on this send button, that is when we consume any REST API that is in this case suppliers, we are getting all the details in this REST API like here supplier ID, party ID, supplier, supplier numbers and so forth things. It is a humongous data what you see over here. But what if our customer is not interested in getting or seeing all those details rather they want to see just supplier ID and the supplier name. So in this case, we will be making use of fields and we will specify the fields that is separated by the comma. Now let me just go back to this API and here I will tell fields. Now instead of modifying it over here, I will create one more request. I will duplicate this in the postman and I will tell over here fields. Now here, what we can do is we can write fields or we can copy paste from this documentation like this and paste it over here and we can write is equal to and we can mention the field names. So field names we can get from this. Suppose if our customer is interested in supplier ID and supplier party ID, then we will write something like this and click on send. Now this time when we make a call to the REST API, we are seeing just the two parameters over here or the field that is supplier ID and the supplier party ID. In case we don't specify this field values, we will be getting all the field values over here. So in this case, we are minimizing the number of fields or the data what we are getting from the REST API so that we can reduce the burden on the tools in which we are making a call for this API and getting the data. So here if you see, we are getting the link over here apart from the data. So the link data is huge apart from this two field data which we are most interested in. So in our next class, we will see how to remove these links and get only the data in the API call.